dude, I have a bone to pick with you guys, okay? You guys keep commenting to me. You guys keep adding me. You're like, bro, you said the iPod Touch 7 generation was coming. Where is that at? Nobody's even talking about it. And I'll tell you like this, okay? First of all, don't call me Shirley. Second of all, in my opinion, what I'll tell you is I'll take some blame, okay? I did say that when that week when Apple was releasing the AirPods 2 and the new fresh refresh Max or whatever, I said there was a possibility that Apple could release it this week. It made more sense to do it then than there. But after setting back and after kind of looking at things, I kind of formulated a new opinion and I made a video talking about that and it seems like we still haven't seen a progression in this sense either so I kind of want to bring it back up again. And here's the thing, it's not a guarantee at all. These are all just rumors, so I'm not going to say this is true or not. I'm literally only telling you what I think, you know. So I will say like nine times out of ten, I am like reporting on the news, kind of seeing what's going on with these companies. But sometimes I like stirring up the pot and seeing what could be pushed with the boundaries out. Here's the thing, okay. As I said before, the iPod Touch 6 generation is going to be ending on iOS 12. I guarantee you that there is no reason and there's no way for me to believe that it will go past iOS 12. I feel like the 6th generation iPod touch is a good device okay it had its time but it's kind of outdated it's literally like kind of low spec for what ios 13 should be bringing so i'm pretty sure ios 12 is going to be the last version of ios that the ipod touch 6 generation is going to have so you might think that's not a big deal but that ipod the 6th generation ipod touch is technically the last ipod that's pretty much been released so far and on top of that it's the last ipod in its lineup that's supported so after this update, you know, Apple's pretty much not going to be selling the iPod Touch 6th generation in its stores. So that would essentially mean that Apple is not selling any more iPods ever in their stores anymore from that point on. Because they're not going to sell a device that's not supported by software when it's outdated. You know, it doesn't really make much sense for them to do that. But the question is, is Apple going to do that? Is Apple going to stop selling a device that's really not taking up too much space in their store? I mean, it's already outdated, but apparently people are buying them if they are still stocking them and still developing them so in my opinion i don't think apple is going to just end the ipod lineup right there and that's why i'm saying apple will most likely bring an ipod touch 7 generation or bring a refreshed one because they would be missing out on some revenue i'm not going to say it's a whole bunch of revenue but they're missing out on something and i kind of classify the ipod as almost like an accessory but not really I, I think it's more than that okay i think the demographic that the ipod touch was kind of going for was like not necessarily like the most heavier user but more so like kids and people who just kind of wanted to bring something when they didn't want to bring their thousand dollar phone maybe if they're working out they can just bring their ipod touch with them and not be afraid to break it or something so the new ipod touch could essentially look like the older ipod touch you know it could be an internal refresh i'm pretty sure they would bring the new updated touch id to it because the new ipods that we saw just like last month or a month or two months ago those brought the updated home buttons and that just makes sense to me that they would refresh and put touch id in it and at first i was like if the new ipads bring touch id then most likely the new ipod and iphone se2 could retain the touch id sensor but as of right now in my opinion i could see it being released with the front home button or being released with that one it just depends on which way apple wants to go but i would take an internal refresh over not internal refresh and the thing is the ipod touch 7 generation is going to be updated with software and supported for a while and apple will continue to sell them for as long as they can until maybe it's at its end of a life cycle then maybe it'll stop there and maybe apple will kill the ipod line but it just seems like it's not too early for them to kill it but it just seems like it's an unnecessary thing for them to do especially since they're already refreshing so many products the macs the airpods the ipads they might as well just just keep the iPod lineup going and it makes sense for them to keep it and announce it on WWDC this year in 2019 because that is when iOS 12 is going to be done and that is when iOS 13 is going to be produced and the betas are going to come out. So Apple could announce the iPod Touch 7 generation then and maybe they can release it sometime later with like iOS 12.3 or something like that whenever that comes out and then it will get the iOS 13 update and so on and so forth. But all in all, it just makes way more sense for me to believe that Apple will release the iPod Touch 7 generation at WWDC this year when the old iPod is unsupported. That way the new one can take its place and Apple can continue to sell an iPod in the stores for people who ever want to buy one at that point. So, And that is pretty much it. If you guys have any questions or anything, leave it down in the comment section below. Hit that like button, that'll mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really does count, so it'll mean so much if you guys could hit that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well. My Twitter, my Instagram, my second channel, all those links are linked down below. I would really appreciate it if you guys could check it out. But more importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. And hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.